would be a good time to find somewhere else to work. Yeah, yeah, right. That's a good idea. <laughs> no, I never liked Fist anyway. I like how they just walk away. I never <laughs> liked him anyway. Oh well. Shooting people is That's pretty funny. Cool, and I got some Paragon points for it. I'll probably just stick with the Paragon, because that's like the easiest thing for me to do. I don't feel bad doing it. Gold Strike. Never tried Gold Strike before. Oh my god, I am not... Okay, wait a minute. I'm not drinking right now, because I don't want to... <laughs> I've been having, like, I was hungover recently, and it was, like, the worst experience again. I, I'm gonna avoid drinking for quite a little while, but I will look it up eventually. I'll, I'll, I'll Google it when, when I'm done with this. Where do I have my... There we go. Oh, he's behind here. Uh, crud. There we go. Oh my god. That took my health out super quick. Come on. And then I think I have... Oh, okay, cool. Let's see here. Don't kill me, I surrender. Smart move. Where's the quarry? She's not here. I don't know where she is. That's the truth. Ah, oh, look at his He's mouth. He's got like all these scars on it. Let me kill him. Wait, wait. I don't know where the Quarian is, but I know where you can find her. The Quarian isn't here. Said you'd only deal with the Shadow Broker himself. Face to face? Impossible. Even I was hired through an agent. Nobody meets the Shadow Broker. Ever. Even I don't know his true identity. But she didn't know that. I told her I'd set a meeting up. But when she shows up, it'll be Saren's men waiting for her. Ah, uh, we have to save her. Give me the location. Now. Here on the wards, the back alley by the markets. She's supposed to meet them right now. You can make it if you hurry. Ah, oh, Rex, you just killed him. Why? The Shadow Broker paid me to kill him. I don't leave jobs half done. A lot of people died because of him. Sick. And then I get two Renegade points for it. Oh, okay, that's good. Let's see. Radioactive rounds. Oh man, that's awesome. This will be good for when I get back on the ship and I can like upgrade my stuff. Garrus is almost dead though. Oh man. Oh crud, I have to hurry. I did not realize that there was a time limit on this. There's also this one drink. Uh-oh. Oh god, there's more of these guys. Crud. Oh no! Ah, I'm about to die. Shoot, she's gonna die if I don't hurry up over there. Uh, let's see, what can I hit? My marksman. Ah, crud. Alright, so let's up my shields. Oh, cool. I think I'm gonna get there in time. This is gonna be good. Got a... Oh, sick! And a level up. Alright, so if I can get over there quick enough... I'll be able to save her. One drink I don't know the name of. They have a local bar. Snake Venom. Right over here is where she's at. No, I'm not feeling brave. Thank you. <laughs> I'll leave that one to you. You can you can keep that one to yourself. They'll be here. Where's the evidence? No way. The deal's off. Oh. 
Uh oh. Okay, let's switch over to this one. Oh crud, what the hell? Oh no! It killed me. What the heck? I'll leave that I'll leave that drink to uh to uh, you there. You could keep that one for yourself. I think I have to start back here. Yep, I have to start from the office. Oh man. That's okay. <laughs> yeah, we have a couple places like that. We have one down here called, uh, or a cool place called Polite Provisions, and, uh, basically they don't let you, they, like, have limits on how much you're allowed to actually drink of each drink. It's cool, though. Cool place. Everyone, like, dresses really retro. Kind of hipstery is what most is how most people would kind of call it. Though. I'm really into that kind of culture, though, so you know that's not. I think that's really interesting. <laughs> ah, Garrus getting in the way. Oh, and he died. I think I killed him. That was probably my fault. Uh... Let's heal up. Ooh. Clear. Are we clear here? Yep, we are clear. Let's switch. Uh, oops. Let's go to... Cool, so I've got two points. Uh, I don't know if I should... Barrier Infiltrator. Yeah, you know what? I'm gonna put them into my infiltrator uh, stuff here. Cool. All set. I think she's safe. Yep, she's safe. Cool. Last drink? I don't know. I haven't been out drinking in a while just because... First of all, it costs a lot of money to go out drinking. That's why I don't like... I don't do it that often anymore. It's still fun. Still a good time, though. I did enough partying in, like, college and stuff. Did you more party- or more partying than I really need to uh, do now. Okay, let's- I can skip this cutscene. I don't need to do it anymore. I already saw what happens. Oh. Uh... Ooh, that's pretty cool. Ah, crap. My gun is totally overheated right now. How long is it going to stay overheated for? Alright, there we go. Restore some of my... Oh my god, this gun is going to just stay overheated for a while. There we go. Let's see if I can... Ah, uh, Marksman's not coming up back up yet. Ah, uh, come on. Oh, shoot. We're close. We've almost got him. We've almost got him. Oh, alright, so he's dead. So there's one Just more guy. Set me up. I knew I couldn't trust him. Were you hurt in the fight? I know how to look after myself. Not that I don't appreciate the help. Who are you? That's neat that you have to wear a suit and they only serve champagne, though. That, I think that's interesting. I don't know. As a 25-year-old, I don't make a big deal out of birthdays anymore. They're fun, but I still don't make a big deal out of them. My name's Shepard. I'm looking for evidence to prove Saren's a traitor. Then I have a chance to repay you for saving my life. But not here. We need to go somewhere safe. We could take her to the human embassy. Your ambassador will want to see this anyway. That was some weird music that just started playing there in the background. What the heck was that? 
You're not making my life easy, Shepard. Firefights in the wards, an all-out assault on Korra's den. Do you know how many... Who's this? A Quarian? What are you up to, Shepard? <laughs> making your day, Ambassador. She has information linking Saren to the Geth. Really? Maybe you better start at the beginning, Miss... I know, I do look a lot younger. Yep, I am 25. Pretty old man. Why did you leave the flotilla? I was on my pilgrimage, my rite of passage into adulthood. Tell us what you found. During my travels, I began hearing reports of Geth. Since they drove my people into yeah. exile, 25, you sort of just get over, get over that birthday kind of stuff. It's still fun, but I'm, you know, I'm to the point where it's like me and my friends basically just like, last birthday, me and my friends just like hung out at somebody's house, had a couple beers and like, had like cupcakes and watched like some of the new season or some of the last season of Orange is the New Black. Like, it, whatever, you know, we had a good time. It was fun. Or at least I had a good time. It's not that big of a deal, like birthday-wise. I don't know if you make a big deal about your birthday, though. Not a bad thing if you do. I just don't care anymore. I forget that I'm even 25. Oh, man. That's Saren's voice. This proves he was involved in the attack. We've got him. Wait, there's more. Saren wasn't working alone. Eden Prime was a major victory. The beacon has brought us one step closer to finding the conduit. And one step closer to the return of the Reapers. Oh no, the Reapers! I don't recognize that other voice, the one talking about Reapers. Reapers sounds familiar. I feel like I've heard that name before. According to the Memory Core, the Reapers were a hyper advanced machine race. Quarians are pretty cool. I enjoy drinking with a small group ago. of friends and how small The Reapers hunted the Protheans to total extinction and then they vanished. <laughs> At least that that's pretty funny. Dead. Yeah, I'm sort of of the no, camp where no, I like, fish. you know, going. Uh, the vision on Eden Prime. I, I like going to bars, but like I only really like and I, I only like going to like the cool the bars and like only like one gastro pub type thing. You know, I don't like going the to these like I don't like bar hopping or uh, doing bar crawls or anything back. like that. That's so not fun the to me. We also have bar uh, barcade down here in our like hipster area of San Diego. The Reapers so, are a threat to every species in Citadel space. We have to tell. Um, I like going there quite a bit, but I, I'm mainly a guy who likes going to one bar, and that's the bar we're at for the night, and like chatting with my friends, and that's it. I don't like doing like I don't like those like bar crawls. Whatever though, everyone everyone has like their own personal preferences, you know. That's why you gotta pick. Like I recently went. Uh, you could be useful. Join us. I'll take all the help I can I recently did uh, went out for my friend's birthday. And Anderson the thing was, we'll is one of us, or one of his friends, really wanted to go to, like, four bars. We ended up going to five bars that night, and it was like, are you kidding me? I just want to sit and, like, stay in one place. Uh, Garrus and... Yeah, I'm sticking with Garrus and Rex. Everyone levels up over time, so... Okay, so now I need to go back. Oh, I should try to decrypt this again. Because I didn't do that before. Got it. Okay, cool. Let's head down. Uh, come on. That stinks that your pubs are filled with 16-year-olds. Do you guys have, like, gastro pubs like we have down here? Like, gastro pub meaning, like, oh. Who's this? Commander Shepard. My name is Samesh Patia. Samish Bhaktia. Oh, that was racist. Nobody, nobody listened to that. That was like really bad. What can I do for you? My wife was a marine. I've requested that my wife's body be returned to me. Why did they refuse your request? I don't know. Okay. All I know is that they have declared it impossible for my Irish pubs are rad, man. There's no reason for your wife's body to be held like this. Just wait here. The man in charge of my case is Mr. When I last saw him, he was. Thank you for the time. Are you a good meet mummy? Are you a good uh, English speaker in general, or do you tend to, or are you mainly like just good at like reading and writing it? Because I know that some people, while they're good at reading and writing, they have trouble. Oh, 
Commander Shepard, I didn't expect to see you here. Did I came on my own. I need him for you. Was there something you needed? Eh, no, I don't. I'll be going now. Goodbye. You know, I have not played Dragon Age. I've heard it's really good, and it's like similar to this in like sort of style. I was recently watching one of my friends play Dragon Age, and it sort of looks kind of MMO-y. You know what I mean? I don't know why, like, I thought that. Or Dragon Age, the new one, uh, is what I'm talking about. It seems a little MMO-y to me. I could be totally wrong, you know, but I don't know. Your activities made for quite a briefing in the diplomatic corps. Yes. A man named Sebastian. Serviceman. Her wounds are inconsistent with any type of weapon damage we've seen before. Oh, uh, whatever. Body might be Return her. No, Commander. Your should I play? Should I play Dragon Age? Dangerous. I mean, is in fact it's it looks good. It reminds me a little bit of Guild Wars or Guild Wars 2, which I played for a lot longer than I want to admit. I understand what you're trying, Commander. You of all people. Not if we lose. Tell Samesh that the. All right, there we go. So I got some Paragon points there. I wanted to run through that conversation pretty quickly, just because these side quests aren't as. Hello, Commander. Can I get you something? What have you got? Information mostly. Would you like to know about some points of interest nearby? Nah. Goodbye. So long, Commander. Have a pleasant day. Oh, that's really interesting. I didn't know that. I think that's pretty cool. Or at least like learning the uh learning it from video games. Ah, I'm Nasana. Oh, alright. Nothing to talk about there. What do you want? Oh, command is there something I could do? What can you tell me about the uh... <laughs> You've never been, have you, boy? I, uh, no, I never did. I couldn't afford it. It costs half a year's credits. You guys get a lot of American exchange possible. students out there in Belgium? That's kind of surprising. Can you at least tell me where I can find her? Zombie! Hey, hey, what's up? Stopping in on the stream pretty late today. I didn't know if you were going to stop in or not. Ouch. Oof. Okay. Let's go over to the Presidium. I like this rapid transit system because once you've been through this like whole thing already, there's no reason to... Oh, I'll... S oh, you know what? Let me use this real quick because I do need to go... I don't know if I bought that... Let's see, Financial District, Citadel Tower. There we go. I don't know if I gave that, uh, if I bought that license for that Hanar. I don't know. I might not have. I probably didn't. Probably forgot. Okay, so here's the part where this is an important part in the story. Come on. Udina's presenting the Quarians. God, I'm like late to the presentation every single time. Eden Prime was a major victory. The beacon has brought us one Well, I'm glad you ended up being able to stop in, uh, zombie. And it's always nice. To the of always the nice to have you in the chat, to able to chat with everyone else narratives. as well as myself. This evidence is irrefutable, irrefutable ambassador. ambassador. Saren will be stripped of his Spectre status, and all efforts will be made to bring him in to answer for his crimes. I recognize the other voice, the one speaking with Sarah. I know, it's kind of funny. Well, I mean, with like... Who's she? I mean, with like... Americans, you know, we already speak English, so it's not really a... The whole video games thing doesn't necessarily... Or video games teaching us English doesn't necessarily help us. But... I totally understand how they can, like, help somebody like you from a different country. Only from like Belgium. From the, Geth's memory core. the Reapers were an ancient race of machines. The Geth revere them. Then they vanished. The Geth believe the Reapers are gods, and Saren is the prophet for their return. We think the conduit is the key to bringing them back. Saren's searching for. Them. But I think that's, that's pretty why cool. He attacked Eden Prime. It is kind of interesting that people say video games, games are useless and make you violent. I mean, it's not necessarily true, and obviously, I mean, obviously, it's not true, but. Do we even know what the conduit is? Sarah not yet. 
that's bad enough. Listen to what you're saying. Uh, I'm so sorry to hear that. that no, it's good to help out your galaxy. parents, though. Impossible. It has to be. Oh, yeah. You, you had mentioned that you were going to have a snow day the other day. Like, have you guys just had snow day after snow day after snow day up until here? Or is it like now snowing again? It rained for like two days over here. I tried to warn you about Saren. This is different. You proved Saren betrayed the council. We all agree he's using the gas to search for the conduit, but we don't really know why. Um, the Reapers are you have to learn four languages? Commander. That's crazy to me. Lie to cover true purpose. A legend he is using uh, no, we don't even have to learn Spanish. Ago, I took a year of Spanish Saren in high school, Michael and then that's it. Again. I actually can only speak Saren English, unfortunately. No it's like, I wish I could go back and learn other languages in high school, but I totally screwed myself. Self over like with me personally I want to learn I would have wanted to learn uh, let's see French but my family didn't want me to learn French they wanted me to learn Spanish so I just didn't have any interest unfortunately but I'm Mexican and it's like my fan like I probably should have learned Spanish it was a dumb decision on my part Send I can me. Take Saren down. The commander's right. There is a way to stop Saren that doesn't require fleets or armies. No, it's too soon. Humanity is not ready for the responsibilities that come with joining. I've always wanted to visit Bloomington, Indiana, personally. They have there's a festival that happens there every couple of years, two every two years or something called Planet X Fest. Let's see. No, it happens soon. Humanity is responsibility come with joining the specters. I'm I ready. I on Eden Prime and exposed him for a traitor. I've proven myself. Um, most four, well, Johnny, most four years, I think it depends on state requirements, too. Dutch, French, German, speaking part, all three of those are official. Wow. Forward. That's crazy. <laughs> Oh yeah, totally. Like, I get it. Like, it's like, well, here's the thing: is like on my people on my mom's side know how to speak Spanish. My dad's side, nobody knows how to speak Spanish. It basically, I don't know. It's a weird situation we have going on in my family. Like my grandmother mostly only speaks Spanish, and I just she has a lot of trouble with English, but she tries to learn it so that she can talk to me and all that kind of stuff. It's tough for her, I'm sure. Those whose actions elevate them above the rank and file. Uh, Johnny, I'm sure it's like, it depends, uh, as far as the language requirements, like, it depends on, um, what state you live in. Like, for me, it was, there's two, like, two, uh, I think if you want to go directly from high school to a four-year university in the UC system, you have to take two years of a foreign language, but you can go through community college and transfer and not have to do a which is what I did, uh, and not have to do a foreign language. Early, I mean, I don't know if it's like that anymore. I'm honored, Counselor. We're sending you and then meet my meat. I think that's insane that you guys have like. Authorized to use any means necessary to apprehend or eliminate. That's insane that you guys have to learn four different languages. I'm incredibly impressed. I mean, that's super cool. I'm I'll ready. Find I'll find it. This meeting of the council is adjourned. Huh. That's really interesting. Is the is your dad's side of your family not Mexican? I'm, I'm only guessing that you're Mexican because of Spanish, or or Spanish. You might actually be of Spanish descent. I don't want to, I don't want to assume. Oh man, it is so dark in here. My camera is super dark right now. Or you are no in Brazil. They don't speak Spanish. They speak something else, right? Bastard I don't know. Thank you. Figures. What do you from a politician? Right behind you, Sick. So I got Spectre training, Charm, and Intimidate. Awesome. Ah, Brazilians speak Portuguese. That's what it is. Okay. I was totally unsure about it.
Congratulations on becoming the first human Spectre commander. Thank I you. Up to the challenge. Dang, look at this guy's eyebrow line. They're I like... Appreciate that. He's My got straight up just like gorilla eyebrows going. Holy crap. Or caveman eyebrows. Like you to deal with our problems. Is something wrong, Admiral? I'm getting stone. Maybe you... We lost... But that doesn't apply to you, Shepard. Don't worry. I'll find them, Admiral. I'm gonna stay here and see... Cool. So I've got a bunch of side missions that I can continue on in this game. Keeper scan. So for every keeper I scan, I get 50... 50 space bucks. And I think there's another one over here that I haven't gotten yet. Oh, well. I'll just leave it. So where do I need to go? Uh, looks like there's somebody over here I need to talk to as well before I head out of here. Really? Your fam but really, zombie? Your family is white, but they just happen to speak uh, Spanish? I think that's really interesting. That's really admirable. That you guys aren't of, you know, Mexican or Spanish descent or of Southern descent. Or South American, I mean. What's maybe wrong? I can help. Mm, well, maybe you can. You're a soldier. This reverse right? is a rough place. My brother, okay, that thank you. Means one of two things. Attack. Privateer. I won't give up on my brother. Not yet. If your brother's still alive, I'll, I'll forward them to your ship right away. Please let me know as soon as you find him. Oh, no problem. Let's go. Sweet. We can head. I think we can head into space now and go to some different planets. Heck yeah. Oh, okay. Well, you said they're white, so I wasn't sure if, like, both sides of your family was white or if it was just your dad's side or whatever. Didn't want to assume anything. Everyone come into this elevator. Jeez. Oh. Didn't realize I had to hit a button there. Doo doo. Oh, they're not going to have any really weird conversation where they don't look at each other. Oh, whoa, Garrus, you are low on health, buddy. We got to find you some. Or, oh, no, I've got Medigel. I wonder if I can just shoot stuff in the Citadel. That'd be kind of fun. I don't think the Asari consort needs to see me right now. I think I'm all good on that front. Nah, you're good, dude. You're good, zombie. Don't worry about it. Uh, go forward. <laughs> the elevator music is nice. <laughs> it's pretty funny. Oh, is the Hanar gone? Now nah, he's around here somewhere. He's got to be. Oh, there he is. Can return to him and give him a. Uh... Oh, and another keeper. Look at all the money I'm getting just from scanning the keepers there. Give me. Yeah. I don't know if this is if I bought it or not. Let's see. Has the CSEC officer been assuaged? Is this really how you want to the truth? Of this one only wishes to spread the truth to any who will listen. Oh, there is let's no go with that. The Enkindlers would, would wish for their message to be spread to all sentient races. The Enkindlers wouldn't wish their message to be spread by... This one hears wisdom. Perhaps <laughs> These guys are so goofy. I love them. This They're ridiculous. And will not intrude upon the Presidium again. Hey, look at that. And I got Paragon points for it. And I didn't have to spend money and just buy him a pass. Or a permit. Happy to help. Here, for your assistance in this matter. Now, if you'll excuse me. I oh, and I got money. Look at. Oh, wait, no, I got Omni Gel. <laughs> My mistake. I don't know if there's anything left to do on here except collect. Really? Like, better than the first one? Because. I remember it wasn't as highly reviewed. As the first one. I think a lot of people thought the like novelty or no, maybe novelty is the incorrect word not the right word. A lot of people thought like the sort of sheen of um, sort of the sheen of it like came off of uh, 
Rapture. That's why people liked uh, Infinite quite a bit. It's because it was an entirely new place. Hello again, Commander. Has there been any word? She's coming home. Reminded Mr. Bosker what we're fighting for. Thank you. I'm... It does not bring me happiness. But it may... Is that it? Cool. So I think I could just head right over to my ship. I'm good to go. Greetings and welcome to the Presidium. My name is Avina, and I. Oh no, I don't need you. I don't need a guide. Our records indicate this is your first time on this. I'll pass. I apologize if you found my service unsatisfactory. Oh Jesus! Now I feel bad for the robot. The Citadel Tourist and Visitor Board. Have a. Okay. Presidium Wards locations. Cora's Den, CSEC, Flux, the Med Clinic, and the Markets. What about Presidium locations? Hmm. Oh, you know what I need to go do? I need to go back into... Oh, that's right. I need to go back into CSEC. That was my fault. Back. That's right. I, so I need to get into CSEC. Yeah, most definitely. Tweet me a picture of it real quick, and I will, uh, I will check it out. There we go. I need to get to the docking bay. That way I can fly my ship out of here. And actually start going on my adventure. So how about it, Garrus? Is this better than CSEC? Fighting a rogue specter with countless lives at stake and no regulations to get in the way? I'd say that beats CSEC. Yeah, that's right, there Garrus. You the champ. You, you but yeah, meet my meat or er, uh I'm just gonna call you meat. That's easier. Oh, so there is an exclamation point there. Okay, so I am headed the right direction. I guess I f did everything I really needed to do until I come back to the Citadel the second time. Oh, thought it was going to be behind me. Guess not. There's Udina. There should be something up here I can collect real quick, I think. No? Oh, well, I guess not. Hey, got some more money. Hello, Ambassador. I've got big news for you, Shepard. Captain Anderson is stepping down as commanding officer of the Normandy. The ship is yours now. Oh my god. She's quick and quiet, and you know the crew. Perfect ship for a Spectre. Feed her well, Commander. What's now, going on, Anderson? What's Why going on, uh... Down, you needed your own ship. I can't keep David. Anyone but the council. And it's time for me to step down. Come clean with me, Captain. You owe me that much. I was in your shoes 20 years ago, Shepard. They were considering me for the Spectres. You Why should you have told me. What was I supposed to say? Ask me later and I'll tell you the whole story. For now, all you need to know is, I was sent on a mission with Saren, and he made sure the council rejected me. I had my shot. It came and went. Now you have a chance to make up for my mistakes. I will, down, Keith sir. David. Don't Sarah's worry. Gone. Let's do it. Don't even try to find him. But we know what he's after. The we had reports of Geth in the Ferro system shortly before our colony there dropped. Oh really? I didn't realize they brewed over here. Find out what Saren was after on Pharos in Bavaria. Maybe you can figure out where the conduit is before he does. Yes. Anything else? We have one more lead. Matriarch Benezia, the other voice in that recording. She has a daughter, a scientist, who specializes in the Protheans. We don't know if she's involved, but it might be a good idea to try and find her. See what she knows. Her name's Liara, Dr. Liara Tassoni. Liara. We have reports she was like his exploring accent. an archaeological Kinda changes dig from game down to game, one though. of the uncharted worlds in the Artemis Tau cluster. Uh, it sounds like we should head for the Artemis Tau. Cluster. It's your decision, Commander. Nice. Oh yeah, because I'm a Spectre now. I can do whatever I want. I'll do whatever it takes to stop Six. Exactly the answer I was looking for, ship. I have a meeting to get to. Okay. What the hell? Oh, I can inspect the weapons. All right, give me one second, guys. I'm gonna hit the bathroom.
All right, back. Sorry, I had to give you guys the chair cam there for a couple seconds. Or for, you know, a couple minutes. All right. Let's head into Normandy and actually to another planet. Can actually do other stuff. Stand by shore party. Decontamination in progress. Ah, oh, that looks so cool. I heard what happened to Captain Anderson. Survives a hundred battles and then gets taken down by backroom politics. Just watch your back, Commander. If things go bad on this mission, you're next on their chopping block. I'm Sarah's ready. Out there somewhere, and we're gonna find him. Everyone on this ship's behind you, Commander. Hundred percent. Intercom's open. You got anything you want to say to the crew? Oh, sweet! I get to make my. Uh, I get to make my speech. This is Commander Shep. Oh, look how hairy my arms are! Orders. Jesus, gonna Find shave Sarah those off. Finds the conduit. I won't lie to you, crew. This mission isn't going to be easy. Uh. This began with an attack on a human settlement in the Traverse. But we know Saren won't stop there. His Geth armies aren't going to stay on the far fringes of Citadel space. Humanity must do its part. For too long, our species has stood apart from the others. Oh, listen to this epic speech. it's time speech. for us to step up and do our part for the rest of the galaxy. <laughs> time to show them what humans are made of. Saren can't Wherever hide from Saren us. Goes, we'll follow. I like that Wherever one as opposed to Saren Wolf. We'll be there. Or whatever we'll the other one was. to the very ends of the galaxy and bring him down. Humanity needs to do this. Not just for our own sake, but for the sake of every other species in Citadel space. Oh, there's Sarah Ashley, the worst stopped. character in the game. Hey, Brett, all, what's happening, bud? Good to see you. Thanks for joining well, us. Commander. Captain will be proud. The captain gave up everything so I could have this chance. We can't fail. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Oh man, I got four Paragon points for that uh, for that speech. It wasn't even that good of a speech. Oh, I think I can talk to Navigator Presley now too. Uh, <laughs> or not? Never mind. <laughs> how you doing, Brett? How's your uh, How's your afternoon going? Thank you for stopping in. Hmm. Let's go talk to a crew member real quick. One of the things I like to do on the in this game. Yeah, 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 playing Mass Effect. Hey, well, thanks for, you know, staying as long as you did, uh, Gianni. Really appreciate it. Um, you have a good night then. I will chat with you later. Where is the Oh, there he is. Commander yeah, playing Mass Effect. I'm glad to hear it, dude. Um, you know, my my day is going good. It's later on in the afternoon right now, getting almost around six o'clock. So you know, getting getting around dinner time. Can we talk? I'm sorry, Commander. I'm oh, I guess. Ah. I'm, I wouldn't mind talking more. All right. Well, I guess I don't need to do anything there. Let's see. I think this is the control room down here? Yeah! I think I can talk to Tali. Amazing, Shepard. I've never seen a drive cord like this before. I can't believe you were able to fit it into a ship this small. I'm starting to understand why you humans have been so successful. Mm. I had no idea Alliance vessels were so advanced. This ship's special. A month ago, I was. I have to thank you again for bringing me along. Traveling on a vessel like this. I had no idea you found ship. It there. comes with, me, but with some of the fleet's larger vessels date all the way back to our original flight from the Gap. What? That was three hundred years ago. All right, there we go. I should go. See you later. And then I think I can talk to him and let her know. Warian Tally, she's been spending all her time down here asking me about our engines. I'll tell her to leave you alone. What? No, she's amazing. <laughs> She's got a real knack for technology, that one. I can see why you wanted her to come along. I figured she'd be a real ass. got an eye for tally, Commander. Okay, there we go. So, let's head over to the, uh, you know, Asari planet. Let's do this. 
be able to uh, recruit Liara, who is like my personal favorite. No, wait. I've said like four different characters are my favorite. I can't choose. That's a part of what's so cool about this game, though, is like all the characters are really good. Like, they're all my favorites. I, d I cannot pick just one of them. I think if I had to pick one alien race, though, mm, probably the what's their names? The giant ones. What are they called? Whatever Rex is. They're the coolest. Uh, okay, so I'm at the Citadel. Oh, there we go. Novaria, Liara's dig site. Let's go here. Macedon, Sparta, Knossos, Athens. Is it this one? I don't know. We'll find out in a second here. Uh, go through these nice little animations here. God, the music from this game is just... It makes the best... It just gives you the best... Uh, sort of ambiance. The sound design is so good in general. Ugh. How long have I been on for? Let's check real quick. Uh-oh. I hope that didn't do anything to the game. Sorry. Going. Looks like... Oh wow, almost three hours. I'll probably cut the stream off in a few, uh, in about 15 minutes or so. Sorry everyone who's popping in a little late on the stream today. Uh, let's open up Mass Effect again. There we go, okay. But as usual, I will have it uploaded onto my uh, YouTube page. I don't think she's on any of these. Nope. Yeah, and here, Liara, where are you hiding from me at? Athens. Proteus. Oh. No, nothing there. They do all these weird, like, survey. Oops. Surveying things. No, nope, nothing there either. Where the heck is she? Is it Kenosos? Uh, we'll find out in a second. Ba -ba -da -ba -da -ba -da. Uh, nope. Let's check the planets. Therum. You know what? I am just going to check my uh, journal here. Let's f find out which uh, planet she's on. Artemis Tau. Oh. Oh, I have to actually like explore each one of them to find her. They didn't know what uh, planet she was on. Okay. I see what's happening now. Let's check our many. It's sort of a weird concept. They they knew she was in this cluster. They had no idea what planet she was actually on. I don't think she's on any of these. Therum? Ah, here we go. It was the red planet. Got it. And I will take Rex and... Eh, I'll take Tali. I think that's a good uh, good mix there. Normally my crew is, see, I'm weird. Normally my crew is like Rex and Garrus. I always take Rex with me. It's normally Rex and Garrus, but like I feel bad if I don't include the other characters. Oh, got the Mako going. Oh, these are awesome. I mean, it's like the worst vehicle, but it's sort of the best vehicle at the same time. This thing does not flip over, no matter what you do to it. Uh, it's like the horses in Skyrim. Oh, do 
don't go into the lava. Don't go into the lava. So I think there's going to be some giant geth things that pop up here, and I actually have to do, like, a real fight. We'll see. Maybe not. I don't know. I could be wrong. It's been a while since I've done this area. Hey, Paradox! What's happening, brother? Let me pull that up real quick. That window. Right? Seth Green is probably, like, the best part of Mass Effect. <laughs> He's pretty cool. Okay, he might not be the best. I over-exaggerate quite a lot in terms of, like... I'm doing really good, man. Thank you so much for asking. Oh. Ah, crap. They got me. Yeah. Got it. Come on. Just chilling. Seventy-three miles for pitching, dude. That's pretty great. As a sophomore in high school, congrats. Got the next Randy Johnson over here. I am using a mouse and a keyboard for this. I never play Mass Effect with a. Uh, I have never played Mass Effect with a controller before. I've only ever played this game with a keyboard and a mouse. Why? Does it seem like I'm playing with a controller or something? Huh. Oh yeah, I can go around here. That's right. Whoa! Okay, maybe not. Huh. I thought I could go around. Only a fool punches a map in the mouth. You should sneak around and pull his tail. Uh, oh, it's this way. That's right. Haha. <laughs> Tried to go up. I, you know what, I like using the keyboard and mouse because a uh, controller just feels, I've never been good with like the dual stick, like. Yeah, there we go. I've never been good with like the dual sticks on a controller and like, for me. Hey man, you know, whatever is good for you, you know. Um, in general with me, it's just keyboards. I have... Ah! I have a really rough time. Uh, ah, come on. Get rid of these guys here. Uh, I need really small controllers to do anything. Uh, it's kind of a weird, like, situation that I have. Where... You remember, there's like all these jokes about like the Mad Cats controllers and stuff and like how they were such bad controllers and whatnot. Well, the thing was is those mini Mad Cats controllers, those were awesome for me. I think I can get out here. Yeah. I, uh, those were so good for me. Like the GameCube Mad Cats controller, the mini one. Oh my god, I wrecked with that thing. Yeah. Oh, there's probably a dude around this corner here. Yep. He's he's waiting here for me. Oh, I got him. Rad. That was easy. Jeez. A lot of people didn't like those mini controllers though, you know? It's <laughs> I thought they were cool. I definitely liked them. I don't know. It's just me. And you. Is that it? I think that was it. Did it. Good job, Ted. Number one. Ugh, my face looks terrible in my webcam, webcam right now. It's super dark. Some days my webcam looks better than others, though. What the hell was that? Oh, it's these... Oh, I opened that front door. No, not the Mako. Okay, here. Let's just open these other ones here. Like PlayStation controllers, those are my favorite. 
PlayStation controllers are like so good for me because they're small enough where like I can actually reach all the triggers and like be comfortable reaching all the triggers and stuff. Xbox controllers are really, really like everyone talks about how comfortable they are for them, but they just are so big. They feel like in my hands, you know, I could just be being dumb and like everyone feels the same way. And I should just like get used to it, but I don't know. There we go. Begin the manual override. Sick. What'd I get? Bunch of stuff here. Open that up. Ouch. Ooh, my neck is killing me. It's because I've been sitting here for almost three hours playing this. Okay, there we go. Yeah. I know what you mean where this one had a good mix of like both uh, exploration and it had a good mix of that exploration and um, uh, and combat. They sort of did away with that, though. Like, they, I mean, they completely did away with it in the second game. Where it was no longer about searching these, like, buildings. It was more just like, here's a planet that you can survey. And then get minerals from for upgrades. And that was, like, a weird system. I don't know. Well, it, it wasn't as good as uh, as maybe this one was. The What really bugged me, though, about this game was the fact that the... It was so... Copy-paste. Like, they just sort of copied and pasted a lot of the buildings. And that, that frustrated me. Like, it was like, oh, I... What the hell is shooting me? What? Oh. It was like... It was very... Oh, I searched this building already, didn't I? Oh, no, it's the same thing and as the last one. And... Ah. That... Maybe that shouldn't bug me. I definitely... Right. I get what you're saying. I... There was a trade-off, though, in Mass Effect 2 as compared to Mass Effect 1, where Mass Effect 2 definitely had this, like... It was almost like it was more focused on your team and the characters involved in your team. And I kind of really liked that. If they were somehow able to get, like, the whole building thing like fixed where they weren't copy and pasting the designs from buildings from one to the other and they were able to keep that sort of personal feeling with the characters in number two i would love that that would be perfect to me. oh cool i killed it i didn't think i was gonna kill it there Hitting up the tunnels! Yes, this is where I need to go. Forgot how long these, like, Mako levels were. The Mako just cracks me up, though, because you can... It's like the Skyrim horse I had mentioned earlier. It's basically the equivalent of the Skyrim horse in terms of its physics. See, here's the thing about that, though. Like, when it comes to character... They did it well with certain characters. I think when it comes to... 
certain characters like Miranda, they definitely didn't have a good, like, writing thing. They didn't have any good writing for her in the third game. Or when it came... But, like, they definitely had good writing for, say, the Krogans. Or, like... Mm, they did some good stuff with the Krogans. And then they did some good stuff with, let's say... Uh, who was the Solarian? Morden. They definitely did cool stuff with Morden in that game that actually made me feel something. And it was good. It was definitely cool. Did I just come from here? No. Okay, I'm doing good. This is the correct direction. Talia? You mean Talia like the, uh... The, uh... The Quarian? You know what? A lot of people didn't like Miranda. I liked Miranda, and I romanced her my first playthrough because she was hot. That, that's literally the only reason. Kind of shallow, but I was like, eh, why not? Plus, you know, they've got all those butt shots of her. How could you not? <laughs> Paradox, that's pretty funny, man. See, I knew I'm not the only one that did that. Oh, crap. Uh. Oh, okay, so it was Q that makes me get out of there. Heal me up. Oh, man. Did I level up? I did. All right. Let's level up some sniper rifle stuff. Nice. And then... What does this do? Oh, accuracy. Yeah, I'll go up a couple there with my sniper. Yeah. Jack, I'm not super interested in. Like, I, she's dumb. She's boring to me. I mean, she's cool, but she's still, like, boring. Let's see here. Spectre training. Yeah, let's do that. And then, I think this time, okay, cool, thank you, okay, here we go. This time I'm going to uh, romance Liara, because I feel like she's the, take all, I feel like she's the, uh... yeah, sniping is way harder. Uh, I think I'm going to go with Liara, because I feel like she's more of the canon character, I don't know if that really makes sense, but I've always felt that she was more of the, like, canon romance, you know? I can go with that one. It has a higher accuracy rating. High caliber barrel. Let's go with that, and then let's see if there's a... There we go. And then pistols. I am a... Ooh, man, look at my accuracy on these. These are terrible. But they all have... They're all stronger. Yeah, let's equip that. Okay. Look at this. Oh my god, that is terrible sniping. Yeah. It was kind of a bummer that she was gone in, like, the first place, you know? Oh, no! I switched guns! I didn't mean to. Let's switch back to my sniper here. Oh, got him! Dang, this, like, sniping is hard, man. Okay. Now that I'm in cover, I think I can get him here. Come on, Geth Trooper. Pop out. Yeah! It's just the gun moves so much, and you have to steady it so much. 
Yes, uh, Johnny, I am going to be playing uh, Bioshock 2 after Mass Effect. I'm just playing this one as a in-between game to sort of, you know, uh, play so I don't tire myself out of uh, Bioshock. Oh, oh shoot. Well, I screwed myself there. Let's switch guns! Go back over to this pistol here. And marksman. Whew! Look at them shooting those rockets at me. Okay, I think I can go back to that. This is nice being a sniper. First time I played this through, I uh, <laughs> I uh, played as a well, up close sniping. First time I played through this game, I played as a uh, vanguard, and I was a vanguard all three. Vanguard was not good in these games, and then like in the third one was the most overpowered character like possible. Like, oh my god. Who's shooting me? There is no way that the Vanguard could have been any more power or overpowered in the third game. Oh, there he is. Alright, cool down. Oh, I missed. Shoot. Alright, one more shot. Got up. Is that it? I think I got them all. Nice. Look at that. Kicking butt. So right after this next save, I'm going to cut off the stream just because it's been a uh, long stream today. Three hours. Longer than I normally do. Once I get to the next save spot. Don't think I can go over here. Nope. Okay. So it's this way. Sorry for everyone who just uh, recently popped in. But if you were interested in seeing the stuff from earlier, I have the, uh, I'll post it on my YouTube page if anyone's actually interested in seeing it, uh, seeing the other stuff. All three Bioshocks? Brett, yes, I am going to be playing all three Bioshock games. When I get the chance. Or are you talking about Mass Effect? Or at least I want to do all three um, Bioshock game or Bioshock games, but in between each one, I'm gonna be playing like a. Uh... Oh, hello! In between each one, I'll be playing different uh, games. At some point, I want to also play Sleeping Dogs on stream. That was one of my favorite games. That one's so good, super underrated. Oh man, this is going to be rough. Ah, oh, shoot. What the heck was that? Oh. Dang it. Let's see if I can switch over to that pistol. Unfortunately. Oh, nice. It just like went down. Come on. Save everybody there. Whoop. Okay, so now let's switch over to the sniper rifle. Oh, nice. That does a whole bunch of damage. More than I thought it would.
Although that cooldown is awful. Man. Um, I think I'll play through all three Mass Effects at some point, and I'll continue my game saves as well. Just, you know, for fun. Whoop. Come on, use a Metagel. There we go. Oh, are you serious? Got his armor back? Oh my god. I'm close, I'm close, I'm close. Got it. Is that it? I think that was everything. Hey! I did it! Oh man, I didn't die either. Normally I die. Cool, let's head inside. And then that'll probably be it. Yep, all right. I'm gonna save the game here, and I will be done for today. New save. Oh, there we go. As per usual, I uh, always update on my Twitter, which is down in the information below, um, uh, below the streaming window. I want to thank everyone who was watching today. Meet my meat is gone, but uh, Brett, Johnny, Paradox, um, and Zombie, the mod. Thank you guys all so much for being here. I really do appreciate you guys watching very much. Uh, it's always a pleasure hanging out with all of you guys and having you all chat with me in the stream. Um, anyway, so that is it for today. I will talk to you guys all later. Again, thank you so much, and I hope you all have a rest, uh, wonderful rest of your evening.